Sunday night's Real Housewives of Atlanta took an ugly, seemingly transphobic turn. Ugh. As you may have seen in the teaser last week, Kenya Moore and Kim's Ulchik Beerman came to both verbal and physical blows while filming at a party at Nene Leak's residence. Drama, drama, drama. Related Kim's daughter has a $2,500 backpack while we normally love the shady shots the RHOA ladies throw at one another. This week, the insults were particularly intolerant when Ms. Moore accused Zolchik Beerman of being transgender in a derogatory manner. It all started when the Doby Tardy star made vicious quips about how Kenya's husband, Mark Daly, doesn't exist. In case you missed it, the former Miss USA winner has kept her marriage away from the limelight and has yet to introduce him to many of her co-stars. Understandably, this fact has caused tension amongst the ladies as, during the episode, many pressured Kenya to bring Mark out of hiding. Amid Kenya's promises that they'd all meet daily soon hopefully soon, Kim snapped it ain't gonna fucking happen, bitch, because he don't exist. It's all a bunch of lies, a bunch of bullshit he don't exist this clearly didnt sit well with Kenya as she lobbed the following at Zolchik Beam and shut the fuck up, okay why do you have such a howardon for me didnt they cut it off during your reassignment surgery oh snap. Although Kim walked away from this confrontation, it seems the feud has continued on Twitter. During the airing of the controversial episode, Kenya wrote on the social media site What a nasty woman at Kim's old Chiak is to talk about another woman's eggs and journey to have a baby. Trash RHOA, Kenya Moore at Kenya Moore November 27, 2017 at Kim's old Chiak screwed Big Popper, a married man for years but shes worried about my husband and my life. Worry about your husband not mine trash box RHOA, Kenya Moore at Kenya Moore November 27, 2017 Unsurprisingly, the Bravo Liberty was ready to offer up a heated response, as she hit back with Sweetie I've been married six years move on. But you call your man baby to try and be like me, you have a white Bentley that I had years ago to be like me remember the Sweetie I'm on two shows and you aren't even on one fired HTTPS T.Cock 3D 3JKFZ 5L, Kim Zolchik Beerman at Kim Zolchik November 27, 2017 Kim also made sure to highlight criticisms that Moore's remark was, in fact, transphobic below. Man, oh man. Nonetheless, Kenya has since defended that her comment was in no way transphobic. She added both Kim and Kenya have shared various social media messages defending their respective stances. What do you think was Kenya's remark transphobic sound off in the comments below image via TYNFWENN? Tax controversy, Kenya Moore, Kim Zolchiak, LGBT, Nene Leaks, Real Housewives, Reality TV, Shade, Social Issues, Transgender, TV News, Twitter This Week in Celebrity Twitpics Instagrams All the 2017 Celebrity Shade were thankful for American Musical Awards 2017 Twitpics Instagrams This Week in Celebrity Twitpics Instagrams This Week in Celebrity Twitpics Instagrams CMA Awards 2017 Celebrity Twitpics Instagrams